Another weird science creation by the people over at Dua, only this is of two fragrances and not 14. These are two massively hype fragrances that just happen to combine together, and let's roll my motherfucking music so I can put you on if this combination works or not. Listen, morning, my beautiful peoples. You know who it is. It's your boy, C to you to the B to the A. Let's jump right into it. This fragrance is allegedly a combination of Blue de Chanel mixed with Baccarat Rouge 540, and they named it Blue de Dua at Casino Royale. What? Legit running out of names. They have no other idea of what they're gonna call these fucking names. This sounds like a shitty translation overseas of an American movie. Shit is crazy. So let's get to the fragrance which I don't know why this shit works, but it works. And you have two super high popular fragrances like Blue de Chanel, which is like super high selling for Chanel designer standpoint. And then Baccarat Rouge 540, which has been copied so many fucking times that it's ridiculous. I mean, it should fucking work. And in this particular case, Shit does work. So what I'm getting from this fragrance, I don't get it much Baccarat Rouge 540 though. I get it more Ariana Grande cloud kind of vibe, which again is Baccarat Rouge 540, just in a very, very, very affordable packaging and a little cloud little bubble shit. It still shares the same sweet DNA that Baccarat Rouge 540 does. It's got that little fur and broxen kind of vibe, sweet candy, very vanilla, kind of crystallized sugar. And then you got that mass appealing and broxen and Bomb, Club Hopper, Chanel Super Popular, Macy's Old Lady Spraying You Down Mix. Shit is good. It's definitely Blue de Chanel prominent, but if you can picture a crystallized sugary Blue de Chanel, kind of going along the lines of what this fragrance is doing. It's like a punchy, peppery citrus, iso e super ish, candied sweet, bubble gummy. I want to put a bow in my hair and have long ass extensions while dancing around to some song. Like, that's what I'm feeling with this fragrance. It's a very nice fucking blend be honest with you. I wouldn't have thought of putting these combinations together, but then again, I don't think of putting any combinations together because I am not Mr. Layers. So again, on skin, it's Blue de Chanel prominent, but you can't neglect that that Ariana Grande Cloud Baccarat Rouge 540 DNA is definitely present. There are certain characteristics here that definitely scream both, but it is Blue de Chanel prominent. So it has a mass appealing quality, absolutely. It's sweet. It has actually a versatility factor to it, which is kind of surprising with a mass appealing flair and a little bit of a youthful vibe that's definitely fun for the budget conscious individual. The citrus in here is quite bright. It's a little punchy and sweet. Let's think of a nice plain margarita that has a freshly rimmed glass of sugar. That's kind of the nose appeal that you get. Your lips get the sugar and your nose kind of gets the lemony tinge of the margarita. That kind of vibe, that's the kind of sweet tartness that I get from this fragrance. It doesn't smell like a big mishmash. It's only a combination of two fragrances, so it's not all over the place. Doesn't smell sloppy on my skin either. On paper, it smells a little bit confusing, but on my skin, it doesn't smell all over the place. It performs actually super well for it being a brighter fragrance. And it's just a fun, playful fragrance. Youthful, energy, vibey. Doesn't want to take a nap in the afternoon or go to sleep at like 8.30 at night. Can still handle his drinks and start mixing drinks all over the place without yakking all over the place or waking up with a searing fucking headache. Not that that's happened to me recently, but I'm just giving you an example. This is not something that the fragrance connoisseur is gonna sit down and analyze and break down the components of it to think of its artistry and creativity and the depth and what their perfumer would shut the fuck up this is a combination of two fun ass fragrances that your budget ass pockets wants to buy and smell good you're not dissecting you're not thinking of the theory of relativity you're not trying to figure out the heritage and lineage of this fragrance let's not complicate our fucking lives there's serious shit going on in the world don't complicate yourself Let's have fun. Let's enjoy life. Fragrance is fun. It's personality. It's attitude. It's vibrato. Big dick energy. Let's enjoy our shit and smell delicious. Is this a ball spray? Yeah, why wouldn't it be? It's Blue de Chanel Ariana Grande Cloud. From here, sweet citrus is exactly what I'm getting. I love y'all motherfuckers from the heart. Is this your type of vibe? I'll put a link in the description. If not, I'll see y'all bitches next time. You know who it is? The biggest in the game. Smooches. Who's best? One of them's gonna pass the test. Who
fly gun holder, money folder, Mona roller, star tag when it's time to call back. It's long since you never get in. It's long since that you would think that you.